sponsor, Petra the Pig. Petra, what's that thing you have? It's a cross. What kind of a preacher are you to not know what a cross is? I know what a cross is, but I'm not quite sure what you're doing with it. Jesus said that you have to carry a cross to follow him. I'm following Jesus by carrying a cross. Um, okay, but that's a pretty big cross for such a little pig. I want to show that I follow Jesus even if it is hard. Well, that's good. But did you know that in the time of Jesus, they actually killed people with crosses? Really? That had to hurt. Yeah, it was horrible. They nailed them to the cross, and before that, they'd make them carry their own cross to the place where they'd be tortured to death. That really changes what it means when I think about carrying a cross. Do you think anyone will kill me if I carry this cross? No one is going to kill you for carrying a cross. For barbecue, maybe, but not for a cross. That's good about the cross, anyway. Since they aren't going to kill you with your cross, what do you think it means to carry your cross today? I don't know. Maybe it shows that I follow Jesus. Well, I think it shows that. I also think that picking up a cross means that we don't just think about ourselves. It means we're willing to do what's right, even if it's hard. It is easier to just carry this cross around. Maybe it is easier, but I don't think that's what Jesus meant when he said to carry a cross. He never said it would be easy. Yeah, this thing is heavy. And I'm not sure that we have to lug a heavy cross around. It can be symbolic. Sinoholic? What is that? Addicted to sin? Symbolic. It means our cross stands for something else. In this case, it stands for our relationship with Jesus. I get that. I think carrying a cross means that we do things for others, even if it's hard. I think it means following Jesus, even if it's hard. I don't think it means having to lug around a big piece of timber all the time. I guess I don't have to lug this thing around anymore. Now, where's something that I can do for Jesus? Bye, Petra.